Warrior Academy is inspiring, beneficial, awesome, amazing, fun, exceptional, the best. The Warrior Academy was created to give students an opportunity to work together in groups, do uh, project-based learning, uh, to challenge them to go beyond what we do in a regular normal setting in a classroom. Colleges nowadays are raising their expectations as to what it takes to get into college and we created the Warrior Academy to help with that pro uh, problem. And it, it challenges students, puts them in situations that they can be successful and meet those challenges that will help them as they get ready to go off to college. They can benefit members of the Warrior Academy uh, by giving the, the uh, person being selected a chance to show that they weren't just here for, from 8.30 to 3.30. They did something else and they, and they boosted up their uh, academic uh, performance. And that's how that Warrior Academy is going to help to select it. It gives that college something else to look at other than you know, just the GPA aspect. Warrior Academy to me means that like it's an opportunity for me to work up with other students in my grade and other grade levels. How it affects it individually is it, it puts on some projects, it puts them just doing it on their own. They, they can't have any uh, other group or, or outside uh, help with that. And it helps them build them with an the individual aspect for that project. But then again, then it also with the group projects, it helps them if they know they can work by themselves and they know they're going to be able to do help that group with their project and that's going to help build even better projects in the future. Warrior Academy gives us a lot of opportunities. One that I specifically love the most is the field trips. The trips, you know, sometimes the kids just need to get out and they need to experience the world. Um, places they may never have been before. Some students have never left this state, so as we take them to Alabama or the Space Center, they may have an interest in rockets, but they've never actually been to a Space Center or seen anything other than maybe a YouTube video. Cherokee, North Carolina, uh, get to get to be in the outdoors. Some kids have never been camping or roughing it for the weekend, so they get to experience that and kind of get them out of their comfort zones. You know, they, they get to leave home and go be with their peers and see different cultures, um, different jobs, professions, you know, how many times have you met someone that works at a space center or is involved with uh, space and aeronautics. So it kind of gets them out and uh, experiencing new things they might not normally be able to experience. Um, and you know, if nothing else, it's just, it's just a, a good break from the norms of the classroom, but they're still learning something as they go along even though they might not be I think the trips the Warrior Academy takes is a, a foundation building for the stuff that they will learn or the, the information that they learn in class and then they see it firsthand with those trips. The Warrior Academy, you know, we have our academics, we have our in-house uh, project-based learning and, uh, you know, we have different ways we challenge our students, but we push them outside of their comfort zone sometimes. You know, we make them go out in the community and do some community service. Warrior Academy is looking to have academic achievement. We want students that are higher achieving in their academic courses. But we also want to go beyond the walls of the school. I think the Warrior Academy here at GC uh, can show uh, this community of Gordon County and also in the surrounding areas that we have something better going on at our school and that's why some of their uh, aspects I think would help us out with some of the people coming in. Uh, it gives also some people that are looking to come into this community a chance to see what this high school is all about. The whole goal is, is just to build well-rounded students that aren't just going to leave Gordon Central as maybe high achieving, but they're well-rounded. They have that community service experience. They're, they're involved in what builds this community. Warrior Academy, uh, in order to be eligible for it, you do have to have a certain GPA. Uh, what we look at is test scores a little bit from, from standardized testing, but we look at overall grades and achievements. Uh, we ask them to list clubs, activities, sports, anything they're involved in, because again, we don't want someone that just comes in with a 4.0 GPA and just see you, go to college. We want people to represent our school and our community, so we want them actively involved. If they're not, but they still want in, we require they get involved and have a role in the school. Be representative of what this school is. The future holds of Warrior Academy, I think it's going to be growing into a bigger and better thing each year we uh, do this. Our advisors, they help us to grow. They want us to grow as a mature individual, as a student, as a citizen, as a whole. They want us to grow up into something that's amazing. If they want those things that they can carry with them beyond high school, uh, that's what we're looking to, to build those students. From the time we get them as freshmen, we just add on to it. And by the time they're seniors, they're prepped and ready for college or whatever life, life has next. We pull them together, we let them, give them a problem to solve and they can be as creative as they want to. But the problem itself isn't nearly as important as the process the students go through. 
and that's a life skill that will help our students from the rest of their life.